Adam Freeman back again here with Rivals 100 defensive back linebacker Derek Davis. We have you listed as a linebacker, but you might end up playing safety at the next level. I know that's something that you're trying to figure out as your development continues. Uh, here this spring, we were looking forward to getting some more eyes on you, seeing how you were able to perform this year at a Rivals camp and potentially earn an invite to the five-star challenge. What were some of the things that you were looking forward to accomplishing this spring? Um, competing, you know, just competing at my um, highest potential, really. And just, you know, progressing and getting better as the year goes on, preparing myself for this upcoming season. Mm -hmm. Now, you were at uh, the Rivals camp last year in Ohio. Uh, you were planning on heading back there this year, trying to earn that invitation to the five-star challenge. Uh, you know, you've seen the players that, that have already been invited to the event and players that were invited in the past. Were there any, but was there anybody that you were looking forward to competing with specifically? Um, no, nah, not really, you know, compete against anybody for me. So I wasn't really looking forward to meeting anybody new. Whoever's out there, I'll just compete. It doesn't gotcha. matter to me. Gotcha. So, you know, missing out on all these events in the spring, you know, the pandemic really shut everything down, not just the rivals camps. What were some of the things that you gained from events like that uh, that really helped your game in the fall? Um, it let me know where I was at as a player and as an athlete. So it, it helped me know what I need to work on, really. Mm -hmm. so. And then competing with top players like you would have potentially at the Five Star Challenge, does that help you see that even more or does it shed some light on, on a different area of your game? Um, both. You know, it sheds some, it sheds some light, but also sees where where like I'm at really mm -hmm. with with myself really. I got you. Yeah, I mean, you're one of the top players in the country, and and you're you're trying to figure out which position you're going to end up at in college. So I guess that that would help you figure things out there. Uh, uh, moving on a little bit, I can't let you go without talking a little bit of recruiting. Um, you've got a bunch of schools that you're still considering. It looks like some of the top contenders for you, Ohio State. Penn State, Clemson, uh, Notre Dame, Georgia, LSU are all in the mix there. Uh, how are things going? Let's start with the in-state school, uh, Penn State. What are, what are some of the things that you've seen out of those guys lately that, that has you so intrigued with them? Um, their, com their commitment towards me, you know, how, how bad they really want me from the head coach FaceTime, FaceTiming me to, you know, having a Zoom meeting with the whole coaching staff, the whole defensive coaching staff. So. Mm -hmm. Let's me know that they really they really want me back. Yeah, I know you've got a lot of connections there as well, and I, I can't I can't leave out the uh, the hometown school Pitt. I know that's a school that you're pretty high on as well. What are some of the things that you look at when you think of that program? Um, so our, like upcoming program right now, you know Narduzzi, he's trying to get Pitt back on the map. You know, I just like what he's doing for the city right now. Okay. How about Ohio State? They've got Coach Coombs back there again, and I know that they're working hard on you. Mm -hmm. Coach Coombs, he's a cool dude. You know, Coach Day, he's doing everything he can to get me up out of Columbus. So, mm -hmm. now, Penn State and Ohio State were the only two schools I think you were able to visit this year before the pandemic shut everything down. Is that right? Yeah, and Pitt. And Pitt as well, yes. Okay. Uh, and then, you know, you had a visit to Clemson scheduled. That didn't end up happening. What are some of the things going on with you and Clemson right now? Um, we're still we're still talking. You know, we were, we were supposed to go down, what was it, April? But, of course, that got pushed back. So, hopefully, we'll be making our trip back down there. Mm -hmm. Okay. Anything going on new with, LA, with, uh, with Notre Dame right now? Um, no, not really. Not really. Okay, and I'd heard that Georgia and LSU have been have been turning up the heat on you so uh, lately over the past month or so. Uh, anything going on there that's really significant? Um, yeah, LSU they they've really been turning up the heat from contacting the, who Coach Bush almost every day they're on Facetime, really, you know, talking to Coach O, and uh, Georgia, you know, they're turning up the heat as well. Me talking to Coach Warren, Coach um, Smart. And they really want me down their bed as well. So, and I'll be making a trip down there as well. Okay, yeah, that was my next question. Do you have any official visits planned at this point? Um, so hopefully, I was going to take an official to LSU for sure, and Georgia. Those was the two main ones I was actually taking an official visits to. Okay, any weekends locked in for that at this point, or or what do you think there? Um, so hopefully, we're just waiting for the NCAA to you know 
listen, let's come out with something new. Mm-hmm. I would let us the recruits know that we could come on campus. So whenever they allow recruits on campus, I'm first flight to whatever college I need to go to. <laughs> Gotcha. Okay. Is that going to, you know, make you hold off on a decision or are we thinking maybe something before the season? Um, yeah, it's going to make me hold off on a decision. No, I just don't want to rush the process. Really. Mm-hmm. So. Very good. All right. Derek Davis, one of the top linebackers, defensive backs in the country and would have been a potential five-star challenge invite. Thank you so much for your time. We appreciate that. Keep working hard and uh, we'll look forward to seeing you this fall. Thank you.